Welcome to Core Performance Insights. Today, we're deep diving into the technical aspects of the MEPC plate carrier by Defense Mechanisms. Hailing from Winona, Minnesota, Defense Mechanisms is a gear manufacturer and training company. Instead of relying solely on personal opinions, our focus is empirical data on the MEPC's capability, materials, manufacturing, and more. With the plate carrier market more competitive than ever, we want to know, where does the MEPC stand? Stay tuned to this episode of Core Performance Insights to find out. At Core Performance, our goal is to build a superhuman future, weaponizing temperature to enhance performance and survivability for all of our end users. We started this Insights video series as a way of answering customer questions about how to upgrade their plate carriers with our suite of thermoregulation tools. So, Ice Age ecosystem integration is where we will start. This is particularly important given the substantial influence of core body temperature on athletic performance. The MEPC is easily upgraded with both our ice plate and ice vents technologies. The overlapping shoulder straps, lined with spacer mesh on the interior, can be enhanced with our Ice Vents Classic or Ice Vents Aero shoulder pads. For a detailed look into the performance characteristics of spacer mesh, click the link in the show notes below. This integration provides improved ventilation, load distribution, and comfort. The spacer mesh plate bag lining is an ideal candidate for our all-new IMS Versa for internally mounting ice plate curve. This allows for conductive cooling, heating, and hydration on both the Molly or Slick variants of the MEPC. For those preferring external hydration, IMS can also be added to the Molly backed MEPC variant. Weight is arguably the next most critical factor in plate carry selection. Right behind temperature and environmental factors, weight significantly impacts human performance. The MEPC medium plate bags tip the scales at 14.70 ounces. And when you add the defense mechanism's 5-inch Molly cummerbund, the weight rises to 23.90 ounces. Comparatively, this places the MEPC in the same range as the Spiritus Systems LV119 and the Cry Precision JPC 2.0. For our next test, we soaked the MEPC in a tub of water for an hour, let it hang dry for one minute, and then measured its wet weight. Details on our experimental design can be found in our other videos. The results? The MEPC logged a wet weight of 40.25 ounces. For a comprehensive weight comparison to other plate carriers we've tested, click the link in the show notes below to our Insights blog article titled Best Plate Carriers of 2023. The MEPC is constructed using 500D Cordura, spacer mesh, hook and loop, nylon zippers, first spear tubes, and a squadron laminate cummerbund. Thermal transmittance is the transfer of heat through a medium or a structure. When talking about plate carriers, we want minimal insulation for maximum heat dissipation. Our baseline for the MEPC in a controlled environment and with ballistic plates was 75 degrees Fahrenheit. After inserting a frozen ice plate curve, the average temperature dropped to 62 degrees Fahrenheit. How does this compare? A closer look at our 2023 testing lineup reveals the MEPC's standing. A brief explainer. A smaller difference between the baseline and ice plate temperature indicates poor thermal transmittance. Conversely, a larger difference means better heat dissipation. A low number signifies a warmer experience, while a high number indicates a cooler one. Unique features. The MEPC does not have any features that are unique to it. A good example of a unique feature is the Velcro quick release on the JPC 2.0, or the shrouded swift clip mounts on the LV119, or the Y yoke on the K19. Three primary mechanisms allow customization of the MEPC. Molly, hook and loop fields, 
and Swift Clip or G Hook. Both the Molly and optional slick rear bags further offer either an ID patch loop field or loop covered Molly. For color and camo pattern options, it's available in a range of colors including black, ranger green, coyote, and various camo patterns. Size wise, there's an added option for 8x10 ballistic plates. MEPC offers five sizes, 8x10, small, medium, large, and extra large. The MEPC in medium features 16 inches of adjustability in the shoulders. Our MEPC setup utilizes the small through XL 5 inch hybrid Molly Cummerbund with 10 and a quarter inches of adjustment in the rear and 10 inches of adjustment in the front. The MEPC caters to various plate sizes. 8x10 fits 8x10 plates. Small accommodates 8.75 by 11.75 plates. Medium caters to 9.5 by 12.5 and 10 by 12 plates. Large is for 10.25 by 13.25 plates. Extra large fits XL 11 by 14 plates. Plates can be of sappy, e-sappy, shooter, or swimmer cut. Country of origin. A product's COO can shed light on its quality, innovation, and craftsmanship. Every MEPC is handmade in Winona, Minnesota, USA. A notable point for those prioritizing Barry compliance. It's worth noting that when we reached out to defense mechanisms to confirm Barry compliance on the MEPC, we contacted them at 3.28 p.m. Eastern Time and got a response a speedy 24 minutes later at 3.52 p.m. Eastern Time. Prices for the front and rear plate bags range between $140 and $165, with a variety of cummerbund options priced from $50 to $175. Our setup, inclusive of plate bags, tallied up to $300 before pouch additions. Thank you for joining us in this technical review of the Defense Mechanism's MEPC. The testing data shows the MEPC finds itself firmly in the middle of the pack amongst those we have reviewed thus far, albeit with thermal transmittance capability in the lower end of the spectrum. Be sure to check out our insights video and blog article, Best Plate Carriers of 2023, for side-by-side -side comparison data. And stay tuned for upcoming Best Plate Carriers of 2024, which will include the MEPC. Visit coreperformance.com or use the show notes links for more insights videos and articles. But before you go, we want to know, are you considering an MEPC? If so, please tell us why. Also, let us know what other plate carriers you'd like to see us review in future episodes of this technical review series. Remember to subscribe and pop those notifications to catch our latest in-depth technical evaluations and stories aiming to build a superhuman future. Until next time, stay frosty.